When I grow up, I think it would be fun to be a baker. When I grow up, I think I would like to be a nurse. I want to be um, a future game. I want to be an artist. I want to be a pop singer. I want to be a cat trainer. I want to be a country singer. Class of 2031, Lee. In the future, when I want, when I grow up, I want to be an entomologist and an artist. I want to be an artist when I grow up. When I grow up, I want to be a vet. I want to be a police officer. I want to be a aquarist when I grow up. I want to be a nurse when I grow up. I want to be a YouTuber. I want to be a teacher. When I grow up, I want to be a YouTuber. I, when I grow up, I want to be a photographer. When I grow up, I want to be a veterinarian. Potter. Potter. Police? I want to be a YouTuber. When I grow up, I want to be a photographer. I think I want to be a YouTuber when I grow up. I think I want to be a aquarist when I grow up. I want to be a game warden. When I grow up, I want to be a magician. When I grow up, I want to be a YouTuber. When I grow up, I think I want to be a veterinarian. When I grow up, I want to be a diver. When I grow up, I want to be a gymnast. When I grow up, I want to be a swimming instructor. When I grow up, I want to be a country singer. When I, wanna, when I grow up, I want to be a clerk. When I grow up, I want to be a veterinarian. When I grow up, I think I want to be a hairstylist. When I grow up, I want to be an astronaut. Um, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be a road worker. When I grow up, I want to be in the Navy. I think I would like to be an engineer. I think it would be fun to be a paleontologist. I want to be a skydiver when I grow up. I want to be a softball player. I want to cut trees down. I want to be a science teacher. I want to be a paleontologist. I think it would be fun to be a park ranger. I like to be a YouTuber. I want to be a police or 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 a YouTuber. I would like to be a professional barrel racer. I would like to be a dentist when I grow up. I think it would be fun to be a Minecraft YouTuber or a Lego designer. I think it would be fun to be a veterinarian. I would like to be a police officer. I want to be a police officer. I would either like to be a, a electrical designer or a professional soccer player. Aiden, class of 2031.
I want to be a veterinarian. I want to be a scientist. I think I would fun to be a gymnast. I think I would like to be a movie actor. I think I would like to be an inventor. I want to be an artist. I think I would be fun to be a policeman. I think I would like to be a, an Ingalls worker. I want to be an inventor. I think I would like to be a doctor. I think it would be fun to be a police officer. When I grow up, I want to be a pianist. I think I would like to be a farmer. I think it would be fun to be an NFL football player. Hello, my name is Booker Taylor, and this is my speech about the habit win-win. One way I've used this habit in the past was a few days ago we had a yard sale, um, and I got rid of some old toys that I didn't want anymore. One win for the buyer is that when when the buyer buys the toy, it's it's um less money because the toy is already used. Um, and some benefits for me is that I get the money for the toy. Um, and how this habit is going to help me in my future career is that I want to be an electric car engineer or designer. So I want to design electric cars. So when I design electric cars, I get some of the money for designing it. And um, when when um, since the uh, electric car is electrical, it helps the earth and it doesn't pollute it. And the buyer gets a cool car, and I get the money that the buyer spent to get the car. Thank you for listening to my speech about the habit win-win. Hi. My name is Anaya Gonzalez. I am in second grade and I am a part of the Student Lighthouse team. Today, I am here to talk about our habit number six, Synergize. Now it has helped me and will help me in my future career. To put it simply, synergy means two heads are better than one. It also means teamwork and open-mindedness. For example, when you are in a group project, everyone's ideas are heard and used to make one great idea. In the future, most of our careers will require us to work with others. This will help us to be more efficient. Nurses, doctors, first responders, teachers, chefs, and mechanics are just some of the jobs we might have that require us to put our heads together. This habit is setting us up for success. I am Ingrid. And I am in Ms. Brzezinski's class, and this is how Habit 3, putting first things first, will help me. It will remind me to do my work and focus on what is important, and then talk to people and play with my friends. Putting first things first will also help me remember to do what's important. It has helped me in the past by reminding me to do my homework before I play with my toys and my friends. It also reminds me to take care of my body by eating healthy food and not just sweets. When I decide what I want to be when I grow up, putting first things first will help me set my priorities and make decisions that will help me achieve my goals. And that is how putting first things first will always help me. Hi, my name is Sasha Banner. I'm a second grade student in Miss Bell's class. I would like to show you how using the habit Begin With Me In Mind can get you to the career you choose. The habit Begin With Me In Mind means to do things right now that will help you later in life. Here are two examples. Let's start with if you wanted to be a teacher. You could start by helping your friends at school or in any subject they need help with. Play school at home. Practice being a teacher with pretend students. When you get a little older, you can tutor younger kids. Let's say you want to become a zookeeper. You can practice on your pets. You can clean up after them and feed them. You can visit a zoo to learn more about how the job works to be prepared. You could 
read books to learn about different animal habitats. You can also read about their diet. When you get a little older, you can volunteer somewhere that has anything to do with taking care of animals. These are just two examples of using Begin With Me and In Mind to achieve your goals. You can use the habit Begin With Me and In Mind to help you with any career that you choose.